this, and then ta-da, you're stuck. And that's why I didn't walk across that. Yeah. Yeah, they just did there anyways. <clears throat> And no, your shields will not make it across. Trust me, I've tried that one. Ow. It's okay, we have health here. <laughs> oh. Now uh, you got it. <clears throat> I saw the health. I knew I could do it. Hey, look, a shortcut going back. There's actually quite a few things like that. Now, in this one, you see these statues that look uh, like kind of like devil ears. Okay. We gotta lift them and plant them. These special buttons will only trigger if something is holding them down. Try using the statue to hold them down. Exactly what it said. How funny that works. <laughs> hey, it's not even like on the thing. It's just gotta be just around it. Oh yeah, and I forgot. Here's a graveyard. Yeah. Over there. Yep. <clears throat> You're doing some moonwalking over there. I see a lot of spiders. Okay, you see that bomb thing? Yes. Pick it up. It's not gonna blow me up, is it? Nope. You want to have it ready. Not like that. Not like that. <laughs> fire! It does, yeah, it does fire damage. You also use, uh, shoot them and make them explode. Fire them at the, yeah, those guys. It does extra damage on these guys, so... <clears throat> it's a good thing we don't catch up on fire. Well, we can, eventually. Bombs. These guys ah. actually deal shadow damage to us, if I remember correctly. Nice shot. It's a good place to use a bomb. Except that's the last one, so... Like, normally I wouldn't even have used that bomb thing, but I know it really helps, so... It's hard to pick it up sometimes. Yeah, it is. It, the game can be pretty fickle at times. Uh -huh. See? Cost zero. Cost zero. <clears throat> level three! Yay! My bomb leveled up. So when your stuff levels up, it does more damage and gets better. You get something at level 5 and level 10, if I remember. Level 5, you get a skill, and level 10, it reduces the charge cost, if I remember correctly. And then all the levels in between just, you know, don't do anything? Yep. Well, they do more damage. Or for armor, see, they protect more. If you open up your weapon, you'll see there's a little small, darker blue section. You're ready, man. Where it just says attack power or speed. <clears throat> Yeah. Then basically, as you level it up, that'll fill, and it'll become maxed. Mm. And I'm gonna log out here really quick. Mm -hmm. And be back in on my other character. Mm -hmm. Well, I don't like that boom that much. That's button two. So you don't like the bomb? Hmm. If it was faster, you know, to like charge and plant, then yeah, maybe. Looks like I got a message log off. I had a message on my other one. I think if you check your messages, you should have a tank. That gives you more energy. A missed tank? Yep. What if I don't want to use it? You don't have to. I'm just saying you have it. Very 
need it. Yeah, I didn't get one. Because you already had one? I've had one before, yeah. That works for you because you can run out of energy really quick. <clears throat> Luckily, people can't see my passwords. So. No, I'm on the Fable Run. So, what haven are you in? 55. 55. <laughs> 55. Entrances. Alright, so off to your left is the bazaar, and up top is the dungeon area. If you want to head to the bazaar first, I'm over there. Actually, like, literally right in front. And on my screen I can show these people some of the other weapons because I have them. Arc Razor is a slightly ranged attack weapon. Cutter is a faster weapon. Ah, I have mostly average weapons. I also have a big heavy sword. I have my original gun and a fast gun and a normal gun. I have several helmets. I have several bodies, including the what? Now what? Oh, this is normal defense. Slow. That's right. Time. My defense shield. These guys sell more weapons than before. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <coughs> there you are. Ah, uh, I'm blocking you out. I'm on top of you because it's my screen. Well, I was blocking you out on my screen. This gun's explosives. Oh, my chunk. Mm. Yeah, they sell bombs here. Thank you. And if a little over here. What's the uh, stars in the bottom? Is that like rarity uh -huh. or? They're rank level. Like you need more star equipment to get lower in the maps. Like right. I have all three and four star stuff, so. I remember that now. I do. Some pretty interesting birds. Birds, chicken like things. Yeah. So over here is the guy that sells the weapon upgrade slots, but again it costs energy, not money, so. Mm. And energy costs real money, unlike and that's so you can use three weapons or have four weapons yeah. equipped at the same time. Yeah. Or trinkets. Right here is a synthesis machine when you get recipes. Recipes cost game crowns. These guys sell armor. Mm. Including this guy has shields. Plug some really nice ones. This guy sells regular armor and helmets. Make friends. Make friends. Oh, this one, uh, there is helmets that give you charge time when your bombs up. Then there's ones that give you downsides. Hello. Isn't it awesome how you, like, attack them and you wave at them? <laughs> Frostbreaker. Yeah, I'm gonna close off those because no, you don't really need to see those. Mm. I can buy you the um, spiral stuff. If you really want to keep trying bombs out. You're gonna buy what now? 
said, do you want to keep trying bombs? So he said, do you like them if they're faster? There's um, equipment I can buy that gives you speed up on that. Plus health bonus. Nah, I'm okay. Yeah, it is a little expensive. So anyways, down here. Down here. Down here. Down here. You have recipe merchant. Oh. A... Or sorry, this is a token merchant. He Basically when you get tokens from bosses and stuff, he'll sell you certain items. This person is a recipe merchant and over here... Maybe you probably don't have any tokens. <clears throat> Over here is another recipe merchant. But yeah, you don't really need to see these guys just yet. They don't really do much for you. Especially when I have, like, all the recipes anyways. Recipes, to make them, cost energy to do. So usually you want to make sure you want the item before you make it? Yeah. yeah it costs something like 100 energy to make. So that's pretty much a day worth of playing right there gone. So that's when you get people like me who are willing to pay a little bit of money for the stuff and we can make stuff. And play at the same time. Yeah. So, anyways, these guys just tell you stuff, blah, 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 blah. Down here you can see different maps. These rotate per day, so it's never the same ones. So do you want to head to one? Pick one. That's uh -huh. for a match. Which one is it? Uh, Curl Queen Gate. Where is it? Oh, that's all it tells me. You have to click on it to find out? Yeah, they're just, they just have different things. It's, they're all the same thing, really. Just different levels, that's it. <clears throat> so the clock no what? on like the little map when you in that menu the queen blades thingy there's a little circle and a little triangle that's where you are currently in that yep thing so we have like three levels to go through before we go down one more or something so this is my um, great sword my regular this might be hanging. My regular I'm sort of trying to level up right now. Let go. One. Two. And three. So this is my cutter. It's my fast sword. This is my arc rager. Slightly longer attack. See so when I charge it. Ah, you got me. Unlike the cutter, which is does this, and I cannot stop that action once it started. This is my auto gun. Uzi. Pretty much. I'm not using that one. I'm trying to level up this one. Oh my Kirkia. And hmm, let's get my thing. Sure, whatever. Yeah, I just made my night blade. So we're gonna stand on here. We're going to a machine level. I can talk as a gear. And by looks it, it's fire and ice or something like that. Mm. Blast Furnace, Infernal Passage. Yep, yeah, it's fire. 